Well, everybody, this is Randy Kennard with Maine Wildlife Management, and we've been out trapping squirrels in Hamden, Maine, uh, both lethally trapping and cage trapping. Uh, we have a number of them to get out of a building before we can seal it up and keep them out. Uh, but the other day we got stuck, we ran out of traps, and this is a repeating trap where there's no the door doesn't have a trigger mechanism. It just free floats, so the animal can come in, push through, get in, and they get stuck when the door closes. This little ramp right there. Um, you got like colony trap, uh, box trap, cage trap, repeating trap. Uh, most times when we use this, we actually get a flange that will go around this, and we can bolt it over a hole in the wall, and they have no choice but to come out and go through it. Uh, but, you know, last minute, we didn't really have it. It was just sitting in the back of the truck. So we tossed it out, we put a bunch of nuts in the front, and a bunch throughout here. We actually had this all wrapped up previously. And uh, we ended up just sitting around right the ground, and the squirrels were actually curious enough and hungry enough where they actually came by, stepped in here, came through, and we've got one hanging out in the back here. Well, he's... We're not gonna get them all riled up. We won't get them all riled up right now. So, we're gonna move on with this little guy. Just wanted to share that with you guys. If you're uh, at home and you're, all you have on you is uh, some old muskrat traps. Uh, they're pretty common. Um, it's not gonna work every time. Actually, it's the first time it's ever worked for us. Uh, but it's kind of nice to pick up, you know, save us an extra trip uh, by using a repeating trap and baiting it enough where they were curious enough and interested enough where they actually work that door enough and then popped right in and we get an extra one. Um, so there's more than one way to catch your squirrels out there. So thanks a lot for watching and we'll see you guys next time. Thanks.